Good afternoon. It's May 28th. The temperature is currently 25 degrees Celsius, which is 77 Fahrenheit. I've been here for quite a few hours already. I did a massive cleanup. Here, I'll show you what I did. Pretty much looks like I took everything from the back and brought it up here. Well, I did with some of the things. But, yeah, we're relatively clean back here now. Getting ready to build the bench back here. Um, yeah, bench seating area for the dinette area. Might get, oh, I can't do the table yet. I need to get a few more parts for that. Cleaned out the bathroom area. Cleaned up all this. No more lumber back here. I put that all into the garage. Tripod set. So I want to try building the bench in this area. I'm probably going to remove one of those electrical boxes. I don't need eight plugs there anymore. Because originally I was going to have this wall as where the TV would be and stuff like that. And that's why I had so many plugs there because it was going to have the computer and everything. But since I'm putting the TV over here, I don't need as many plugs over here. So let's get your brightness down because you're a little too dark now. I mean too bright. There we go. So I'll take a few measurements, cut up some pieces, and I'll be right back. Let's see how this works out. Be back shortly. <clears throat> I have all my pieces cut. I have everything pre-drilled ready to go. Now we just have to hope it all works. I screwed these two pieces in together because this is going to be for this side here. I already have marks on the wall and on the floor for uh, where the pieces will be going. This piece is a little shorter, so this way the lid of the the lid of the seat will sit down on top of this. Also, I don't have a second piece. All right. So the lid will sit like this. Then the one by fours, I'm going to put right like this. So I'm, I'm going to have this, what do you want to call that? This lip, I'm going to have this lip. This lip is here, so when the table that'll be sitting up here comes down to make the bed, it'll sit on top of this lip. Makes sense? I think it makes sense. Then again, I don't know. So we'll see. This needs a little bit of a shave again. I'll just sand it down after I get it in place. Or I can just leave it as is. It doesn't really matter. So, let's screw everything together. And pray it works. Just like on the other bench I built, I'm going to put this piece up high, flush with this piece. This piece is going to be three quarters of an inch lower, it's going to be flush with this piece. Then when the lid closes, everything will be level.
Backwood, drop the camera. Wrong, wrong one, wrong one. There we go. Let's get you there. math did not work. I'm way off somewhere. This piece of plywood is way too big. That's because I have it for doing that, don't I? Yes, I do. Why didn't I just do that? Oh, right, I, won't, I don't want it tight to the wall because I have these lights up here. So when it flips up, it would have hit the lights. So that's why I put this barrier here. So I just have to trim an inch and a half off of this and I'm good to go. How's this end? Way too far as well. Did I miss the inch and a half again? this up over here. Yes, I'm off by an inch and a half on both ways. So I'll be right back. I'll cut this to I'll cut this down and then I'll put it back in place. See you in a couple of seconds. Yeah, that took a couple of cuts to do because unsurprising I didn't make, make this square, the wall square. So when I built this, it ended up out of square, so I had to trim just a little bit off a couple of corners on this lid but otherwise it fits nice now there wasn't much of a difference it was off by like an eighth of an inch so now I just have to put the That's too long. Does that matter if it's a little too long that way? I don't think it matters. I can put it like this. Yeah, that's fine. That is fine. Famous last word, fine. How is one sheet of three quarter inch plywood thicker than another sheet of three quarter inch plywood? Because that's what I used to gauge this, and here it's off by quite a bit. Whoa. Almost took you out. Let's see if we can switch it around this way. If that makes a difference. Yeah, it doesn't fit that way. Alright. Let me do it this way.
Okay, so I have to lower this a little bit. Yeah, something warped somewhere. left is to do something else yes here again I'm going to put one by fours across here like this one by fours up the side then this will slide out sounds like plan so again let me cut up the pieces first See what I have to cut up because this will not equal one by fours perfectly. 21 and a half inches. So I have to figure out how I'm going to do this. So yeah, sit tight. See you in a few seconds again. And uh, I'll have the pieces here. Be right back. Well, kind of surprisingly, the 21 and a half inches was perfect for six pieces of wood. For six pieces of wood, so I didn't have to cut anything down. So I'm going to do the same thing as I did on the other on the other bench over there. Is you can see I already have these screwed into place. I'll screw the tops of these ones into this one so that when I pull this out, it all slides out. And these other ones, they're only going to be screwed into their top pieces here because when, the, when it lifts up, this has to come up with it. I'm not going to make that mistake again like I did before. So, I'm going to glue the bottom side of these. Sorry. I'm going to glue the bottom side of these, then use the air nailer to nail it into place. I'll need to do that to the, uh, every other one. And then I'll bring this into place. I have to put it just a little higher, otherwise I'm a dope. Otherwise this won't be able to slide in and out because I've cut these all the same length again and if I keep that tight it wouldn't move out properly. So let's Get to this thing, finish this off as quickly as we can. Ooh, I do not want to have that. Let's put that as the middle one. No. Let's put that as this one. It has a pretty bad uh, knot over here and I don't want it. It makes no difference because wherever I pull it out, somebody might get a sliver.
I think it works pretty good. And again, I'll put a strip of a quarter inch plywood here, put another one there, another one back there, and I'll just slide back and forth easily, keep these things in place. Somebody stuck somewhere. Well, either way, I'll figure that out, and we're done. I'd love to build a third bench sitting where that fan is sitting, but I have a wall to build first, and closet, uh, the closet where the electrical is to build as well, so we'll see. I might build it within the next few days, probably not, because I have a lot of other things to do. I don't know what they are, but I have a lot of other things to do. Anyway, that's it for today. Hope you have a good one. Catch you next time.